Welcome to my day in the life. I hope you enjoy. This is the look today. Just my jeans and a cute little top. And I've got on a little um, cardigan, but it's got a hoodie at the back. Because it is a little colder today. Um, I don't know if it's colder. Like, my room doesn't feel colder, but it's very grey and rainy. So, not a really fun start. But, um, good morning. <sighs> it's it's bright and early i'm tired as always but no today's gonna be a good day i do have a morning class which is like three hours so that's always a little tricky one because in the last half hour i'm just struggling to pay attention but it is it's a really interesting course so i'm not gonna complain because i like the course um what else do i have today i have yeah i've got a I have a group project meeting as well so that should be good i'm thinking i might stay and work till like five and get some work done i'm still doing my thesis readings like i'm still doing that still struggling um so if you have any advice on how to read academic papers i would be very grateful but yeah so should be a good day though i'm excited um i'm i'm excited um but no should be good um well not the bins still vlog the bins too <laughs> I'm vlogging the BP. We're going to King's for 9am, which is so exciting. Can you tell we're so excited and happy Yay. and away? Have you looked in Google it? <laughs> okay, so yeah, if you haven't done that, I think that's a good way of finding. What have you done for your visa so far? Um, oh, let me show you. Let me show you. I made a thesis folder called Thesis. <laughs> you do. Uh, <laughs> I mean, step one. <laughs> step one. Um, links. So this is. I tried. I did it for one. Oh, yeah. Um, but you gonna put this in your vlog? Sorry. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> um, no, it's just gonna have music over this. Um, Lunch time. Nice. Ta-da! Made the same thing. Do you approve? You look like such a. Just want to decide if I'm gonna do a seawater break. Does someone have Scotland that in my group? What's know? a breakwater? Does someone have Scotland? No. no. Oh. <laughs> Scotland's coasts aren't that interesting. I yeah, think. Scotland's, I feel like, rocky. Enough. So after the lunch break, I carried on doing some more work. I made some progress on my coastal class, which I'm happy about. And side note, I am such a bad study partner. Look at me just rolling around. But that's because I focus for like 20 minutes and then I lose focus for five and then I focus again. I know it's horrible. Anyway, I ended up staying till around half four. So that was a good productive study day. Have you heard um, Joe Jonas's new song? I knew he was releasing new music because every time I opened song. TikTok, yeah. he came up and must be releasing yeah. something. <laughs> I was like, why is he suddenly so active? Um, is that a good? Is it good? I, I actually I like have always it. liked his When he was in that other band, I really liked that music. Um, yeah. What? The NC, whatever. D yeah, them. Yeah. It's, it's similar vibe. Similar like vibe. That poppy kind little funky pop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A day of studying done. And I am so tired. I'm going 
to be making this really cool pasta that I saw on TikTok and it's basically she makes the sauce by roasting peppers, sweet potato, tomatoes, a bit of garlic and then she blends it all together and that's her pasta sauce and add in some like spinach and butter beans. I tried it like a, a week ago and it was so good so I'm gonna make it again. So yeah, I went to the shop, got my peppers, spinach, tomatoes, and butter beans, sweet potatoes, and of course the pasta. Um, I also got these crisps which I'm loving right now. Um, they're like sea salt with a little bit of um, balsamic vinegar. Um, and it's just like the perfect amount of sea salt and balsamic vinegar, so it's really good. So the first step is basically just roasting all the veggies. So you just need to cut all of them into really nice roastable pieces. So I've got my peppers, my sweet potatoes and my tomatoes in there. I seasoned it with a bit of um, salt, pepper, a little bit of um, paprika and some olive oil, obviously. And then you can add anything else you'd like as well. Just mix them all together. Um, and yeah, and then roast them. It's me taking out the rubbish, ill, but chores must be done. Anyway, here's a little engineering ramble for you. I went to this lecture where the guy talked about climate change and net zero in a sociological way, which I've never thought about like that. Because as an engineering student, it's always solve the problem kind of direction we take, you know, being more technical about it. But the lecture was based on how the reality of our economics, being very short term goal oriented, and how we've kind of normalized this way of life and made it seem like the only way. But actually, we need to first accept the reality that our way of life isn't sustainable, you know? And that was the main goal in tackling and trying to achieve net zero is accepting the reality first. So I thought that was quite cool. Um, very interesting and a very you know different way for me to think about things so yeah i thought i'd share the pasta's ready rinsed out the water and then put it back into the pan and now i'm just getting the blender stuff ready i don't have like a proper big blender but a little hand blender and it works perfectly fine just put it all into here a bit of hot water and then should be good okay Everything's all nice and roasted, looks good. I think this side got a little bit more heat than this side, but that's okay because we're just going to blend everything and I'm just going to scoop it all up into this pot and blend. <laughs> okay, this is a lot harder than you'd think with a <laughs> Okay, so it's still not as smooth as it could be but I really don't know like how much smoother do you think I'll be able to get with a hand blender you know like it's pretty smooth enough so I just call it a quit um yeah so then you add the sauce into the pan Spinach, baby. We love our spinach. is nearly ready and honestly i'm so excited at this point i was starving because the vegetables took forever to roast but honestly this is one of my favorite recipes and i love how cream it is you'll see in a sec how creamy it actually is and there's no cream added for it to be that creamy but it's just a sweet potato that gives it the perfect texture so obsessed with it right now and also a fun fact for you guys I only realized that butter beans are called butter beans because they taste like a little like butter and I'm obsessed with butter and so the first time I tried butter beans I was in love so a little mind blown by that fact but did you know that amazing anyway yep um you'll see me eating the pasta and you'll see how gorgeous it looks so get ready for that ta-da that's my pasta look how good the sauce looks you know nice and saucy and creamy and like there's no cream in this at all like no cream just the veggies and look at it, it looks so good and i can already smell it. it smells great um yeah i 
am so excited to show off my little tool. It just came in the mail and my older brother got it for me. And isn't this the coolest thing ever? It's so that I don't like shake my phone when I'm like recording. But now I can just hold it like this. My hands don't hurt and it lets me like video things so much better. Anyway, I'm very excited to use this. It also has um, this like comes out and I can use it as a stand. So very, very cool. But yeah, I thought I'd show it off. Now it's 9 p.m. and I'm ready for bed. My brain is sore from all that studying, but I feel good. So today was a really, really good productive day, you know, lectures in the morning and then spent some time studying, doing some work, spent nine to five at uni, which is what I really like to do. I like to do like pretend my uni days is like my work days kind of, you know, do a whole nine to five and then try to keep my evenings free and for cooking and socializing or whatever. It's it's just nice to have that routine so it doesn't feel like my life is so chaotic. Um, but yeah, so did a full day of studying, did some meal prep, very happy with my pasta, as I keep saying, because that's one of my that's one of my like favorite recipes, you know, like the things that you know you're good at cooking. That's one of mine. So happy about that. And yeah, and now I'm just gonna chill maybe watch some netflix um and then go to bed and maybe read my book i've been reading the lord of the rings so that is good um but yeah so <laughs> Another night, another f-